Welcome back everyone to this little Zelda game and it's time for us to go into the jump bowl but first I want to see what the heck these, these fruits really refill anything no they don't they just pop they're like look for the fruit in the tree to re restore your freaking da 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 or whatever you call it um my Deku seeds but that does not work no stop give me my gear no not my map in my gear. Here we go. Okay, so I have this revitalizing potion. Fully replenishes your shield gauge and restores four hearts. But I don't even have a shield. Right? It's like broken. At this point. Hmm, I think. Yeah. So I let it break. Um, so before we go into this temple, I'm going to actually go back and get a new shield. I know that seems kind of silly. But we're gonna test this out. We'll go to the sky and get a new shield because we can shop there. And whoa! Sailcloth up on the giant vent of hot air. Hopefully it's warm and toasty. And, uh, here we go! Yeah. Bird me up. Be Master Link. You hit that goddess cue with a skyward strike earlier. I was able to detect a resulting energy reaction above the clouds. Oh, there it is. The location I marked on your map indicates a spot where I sense an energy reaction. Let's go find it. I advise you investigate the area around this location. I quickly want to go see that before we get our shield, just because it seems pretty dark. There's the beacon, okay. There's the green beacon in the clouds. Now I'm gonna go investigate the cube beacon. Because I did make that cube appear, and so I kind of want to see... I didn't realize you guys you guys told me this thankfully that you could shake the <laughs> shake the Wii remote to gain altitude. That's a big, big help. I don't remember ever reading that. I don't know where I missed it, but this would have made the whole like bird catching mission infinitely easier. Alright. Bomb dive in here. In this little island. Oh, there's a house. A pumpkin house. Dude. Land, 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 land on land. Just no, just mount. How do I, don't... How do I get off the freaking bird? How do I get off? No, oh, dude. I don't know how to land. not working. Never told we how to land. Oh, there we go. Down on the D-pad. Okay. Good thinking. Alright, let's go. Is this my purple cube treasure chest? Purple like cube. You made your adventure pouch bigger! Yeah! Alright, that's cool. You can carry more stuff and stuff now. All right, let's quickly just run around this little island in the sky. It's pretty cool. Um, and it's a pumpkin field. You know how I feel about pumpkin fields. Remember what happened last time we ran into some pumpkins? I keep forgetting he gets tired. It's okay. I kind of like watching him look like an old man. All right, let's go inside. See what's up. Who lives in the pumpkin house? Mrs. Pumpkin. Oh! A little... little restaurant slash coffee shop place, my bob. The Lumpy Pumpkin. It's <laughs> pretty funny. What's up? Welcome to every bird rider's favorite rest stop, the Lumpy Pumpkin. This is the one and only place you can enjoy some of our famous pumpkin soup. Wanna try a bit? Sure. I'm impressed that a young man like yourself can appreciate the refined taste. Just 10 rupees a bottle. Oh, I don't have any more empty bottles. No thanks. I get it. This place is good for more than just drinking soup. You can also meet some colorful folks. Don't break anything. I made a mess. Especially my special order custom-made chandelier hanging from the ceiling. I don't want to see you shaking it. All right. You believe me, don't you? Believe what? 
there's a fiendish demon living in Skyloft. I'm telling you, I came this close to getting eaten by an evil beast. You look like you've gotten a little night training, but you better keep your guard up or take a bite out of you too. Okay. Hi. Listen to this. The old guy over there says he saw a demon. He's obviously trying to get Kina's attention, but he won't get anywhere using creepy lines like that. Is this Kina? Hello. Hi. Well, well, welcome. You look like Lilo from Lilo and Stitch. I can see from your handsome outfit that you're a Skyloft knight. I hope you'll make yourself at home. Have the rupee sitting on top of the chandelier caught your eye? Don't go thinking that you can get those down, you hear? You might think that you could knock the rupees down by bumping something and making the chandelier shake, but don't even think about it. Are we clear? I'm gonna make it shake. Let's see, what if I go upstairs and bump it? You! Huh? Hey, Link. I didn't think I'd see you here, but you're wondering what I'm doing here. Yup. <laughs> I think I mentioned this before, but man, I'm really into bugs. That's why I'm out collecting insects wherever I think I'll find them. If you have a bug net too, you should try catching some. If you don't have one, you can pick one up at Beetle's Air Shop. I'm sure that's why you scrap your eyes. Right? Let's see, what if I... Roll into this? <laughs> Shaking. I don't think it's shaking enough. No rough housing on the balcony. There we go. Yes! Dump that stuff off. <laughs> Why would you do that? Get down and come here this instant. Oh my god, I'm sorry. I just really wanted the rupees. Now accepting applications for workers to plow the pumpkin field. I'm, I'm pro at that. Yeah, I can't climb over though. Fine, I'll run down the stairs like a civilian. You got a piece of art, collect four, blah blah blah, you to go, yeah! Oh. What is wrong with you? Just look at what you've done. You broke my fancy custom order chandelier. You're gonna be working with me for free until you pay off every single ruby that chandelier cost me, got that? You ready to own up your responsibility? No way! What do you say? You got some nerve coming here, busting my chandelier. Goodbye. I'm sorry. Maybe he would help me if I did sing for him, but I like how everyone's like depressed now. What do you need me to do? Deliver soup. All right. I guess. Give it to me. I'll take it. Need an empty bottle, okay. Alright, fine. Hey, suit yourself. I was gonna do your job, but you don't want me to already, boy. I'm out of here! I gotta get back to Skyloft and buy my shield and then go back to that temple! It's temple time. And the first dungeon in Zelda is always exciting, because you, you learn so much about what the game's gonna hold in the future, and you see things, and this game's just so Yeah. Bam! I kinda wish this wasn't a cutscene. I mean, it's very short, but I kinda wish it was... This is the main skyloft over here. Well, that's where we're going. Fly through this ring here. Looks like there's a burst of speed or something, maybe? Shall find out. Whoa, a big burst of speed towards the island. I like that a lot. That is mighty, mighty cool. It is pretty cool that you can land in real time up on these places, which is nifty. I'm gonna land up here. Try. In fact, it doesn't look like there's anything up there. So, we're gonna dive down right by the bazaar. Yeah. Oh, I was hoping I could go land in real time like I could on the small island. Apparently not. Skyloft, it's a big island. Wham! What's up, peeps? I'm gonna go buy a shield again because I broke mine! So I have to, guess I have to pay attention. When it gets getting low, repair it would probably be the best idea. Um, oh my! What's this? What is that my eyes behold? Oh, young man, what calamitous vision appears before me. You may choose not to believe me, but my eyes foresee a hazardous, thorny road ahead for you. But I can foresee what will befall you, for I am a fortune teller. Trust my piercing eyes. Listen to my pure and innocent voice. I will do you no harm. Gaze deeply into my eyes and come closer. Okay, you freak. Stare deeply. These eyes see many things. Oh yes, these lovely brown eyes can see even into the future. 
Allow me to tell your fortune, boy. I look upon your shirt, boy, and I see a single thread loose in your sleeve stitching. Nothing can hide from these uh, uh, One rupee, okay. You want me to tell your fortune? Do you dare discover what fate these eyes see? Yes. <gasps> what a treat. You are the first customer I've had in a while. Oh, I mean, I'm the best at what I do. You can trust these glistening eyes. Very well, let me see what I can see. Yes, your fortune, it's all coming into focus now. <laughs> oh, there. Yeah. Ah, I see many things. All is revealed. Young man, are you about to head into a densely wooded area? Somewhere blanketed in green? Yes. Ah, my eyes, they see all trees everywhere. Yes. Many trees. It would serve you well to buy a wooden shield before you trail. Thanks. I can see that you're a bit young and green yourself, so it couldn't hurt to take a heart potion with you. I have that, too. That's all I can see for the moment. My eyes, they grow weary. My dog is barking. Good luck, young man. Thanks. You didn't tell me anything I didn't know, but that's okay. Um, I will take another one of your wooden shields. Uh... You got a wooden shield. It breaks easily and burns and da 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 da. <laughs> You're creepy, girl. Alright. Let's see if he can upgrade my shield. How much are the bombs? I don't know what was this. Ten additional seeds. Recommended for slingshots. No, I don't want it. No thanks. <laughs> is this a guy or a girl? I don't even know. I'm guessing it's a guy. I don't know. Or a girl. I thought it was a girl. <laughs> Ten Deku seeds. Perfectly matched for selling shorts. Yeah, I'll buy these. Yay! I like how Link has telekinesis. can make everything float above his hand like that. <laughs> Pretty darn awesome. Alright. And how much are the bombs? Oh, I don't have a bomb bag. Yeah, okay. Um, let's go talk to this guy and see if we can upgrade our shield. I've got some stuff, maybe. Hey, welcome to the scrap shop. I can use the stuff you find to upgrade in your gear and make it even stronger. Oh, I didn't need to buy a new shield. Shoot! Maybe I did, because it totally broke. These are all items you have that I can upgrade now. Let's see. Oh, I need Monster Claw and Jelly Blob. No! You can't upgrade that, you just have... Alright, well. I'll see you later, sir. I don't have everything I need. I'm sorry for- I'm not trying to waste your time, I'm just- All right. I got what I need, I'm out of here. Time to go back to the temple. The forest temple where we meet our fate, and a boss, probably. A boss, a boss, a boss, I love bosses, I miss bosses in games. I know that sounds kind of silly, but I do. Um, let's see, can we just bird statue back to the temple? Does that work? No? Can I fast travel at all? Huh. I'm really interested to see how this works, so if I go... Mia. Hey. You're not demonish. Right now. If I go and run off here, over here, can pull it, um... Like, do you know what I mean? Will it let me... I hope it lets me fast travel back to the forest. And not, doesn't just make me, like, have to run through everything again. That'd be quite disastrous. Let's see. Shall see what it does. Oh, it lets me just like pick any of the bird statues. Now that would be cool. It lets me do that. Warp into any of the bird statues. I would really be a big fan of that. It's so pretty through the clouds in the sky. I'm falling. You wanna let me pick where I go? Yes! A report, Master. It is possible to descend to a specific bird statue in the service after you've already visited and I have memorized the location. To do this point, the area you want to descend and press A. I like it a lot. Okay, so. Forest Temple. Descend to this area? Yes! That's so. No, I didn't mean to do that. Uh, yes. Descend to this area? Yes. That's so sweet. Don't you think that's amazing? Oh my god, no backtracking. Fast travel in the Zelda game? What? What? Alright, perfect. Okay, and we're gonna save here. In the next episode, we will enter the forest temple and take on the demons inside. Thank you guys very much for watching. A fantastic day. We're saved and powered up and ready to go. And we met the pumpkin guys and broke their chandelier and did a lot. So, until next time, guys and girls, have a fantastic day. Drink some hot chocolate. We're ready for this temple. Until next time, we will see you all later.